Now, here's Chief Meteorologist Tony Petrarca with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. Well, certainly a chill in the air after a couple of cold nights this past week and temperatures now only in the upper 40s. As we take a look at live pinpoint Doppler 12 radar, clouds have been streaming in with a little bit of sunshine sneaking through, not finding any precipitation, at least not yet. But I am tracking uh, a developing offshore storm. Uh, the bulk of it should stay out at sea, but coming close enough to impact our weather next uh, 24 to 36 hours, uh, the wind will start to pick up as well. And we do have some at least chilly light rain ahead and we'll show you the specifics and the timing in just a second but you see extra clouds and only partial sunshine in Providence right now temperatures that's it only upper 40s to around 50 but you throw in that breeze and it feels cooler wind chills have been running in the lower 40s now the satellite radar composite you see this canopy of clouds coming up from the bottom of your TV set developing storm is offshore off the Carolina coastline and coming close enough to graze the area with some wet and chilly weather so the temperature is really uh, you know, nothing to write home about as far as uh, warmth. In fact, uh, really not much of a swing from daytime and nighttime. Starting off this evening at around 7 o'clock in the mid 40s, we'll drop a few degrees overnight to the upper 30s to low 40s. Here we are at 6 a.m. starting off the day at 42, 43. Normally, with all day sunshine, these numbers would recover to around 65 this time of year. Not the case tomorrow. Look at this. It struggles to get to 50. Upper 40s, briefly near 50, but the combination of some wet weather, the wind picking up will make it feel raw and chilly. So it's the kind of day where you need, uh, well, the, the sweater underneath the raincoat. Here we are, 7 o'clock tomorrow evening, and it's still in the upper 40s. So your bus stop forecast uh, showing sprinkles in the morning, the temperature at 43, talking about the, uh, the raincoat for the little ones and the warm sweater, and not much improvement during the afternoon. That would include the evening commute coming home. It'll be kind of raw, windy, and wet. The rain, not real heavy, but at least uh, lighter showers. Uh, the umbrella and the raincoat, uh, the weather gear for the second half of the day. Seven-day future cast uh, showing the gloomy weather for tomorrow. But again, we're just getting grazed with this. So as far as excessive amounts of rain, we don't see that. Though the wind will be brisk, especially along the coastline. There is a small craft advisory boaters. Talk about marked improvement on Wednesday. This is more like it. Here it is hour by hour, 8 o'clock in the morning, 49. But by mid to late afternoon, with sunshine, temperatures recover to around 67 degrees. So we're talking almost 15 to 17 degrees warmer on Wednesday compared to Tuesday. Thursday, not bad, partly sunny. Friday looking okay. And the early call on the weekend would be for some sunshine, both a Saturday and Sunday. That's good news now that the Little League season has kicked in across most areas across southern New England. Daytime high 60, 65, and nighttime temperatures in the uh, lower 40. So a bit of a bump on the road for tomorrow being the uh, the worst day of the week but cold windy and raw for your tuesday a little rain is okay for the grass okay <laughs> thanks Tony.